Hi, welcome to Lesson 36. I want to show you a really cool feature that has uh, been added by Microsoft to Excel 2007. We filtered a number of different ways by dates, by text, by numbers. There's a cool way here that you can now filter by color of the cell. So I've set up a couple of different colors here. We'll start with an easy one. What I did first is I went through and I said I want all of my patients who are from Florida to I've highlighted them all in uh, red so if I want to find the Florida patients I mean obviously I could select Florida because there's this is a simple uh, select or a simple filter right now but you can go to this filter by color menu and Excel says hey you've got two different colors in this uh, in this column you've got the automatic which is nothing which is the way it comes out uh, when you just type it in automatically and you've got red and if you want to see the red ones there they are now I've got only my Florida patients and they're sitting there the next thing I want to show you is if I want to just see Florida I'm gonna come over to date and what I've got in date here is I'm gonna go over and filter by color and look what I've got here I want first let's just pick the cell color I can filter by the cells color or by the fonts color let's do the cells color of blue and so if I click that what I'm gonna get is now I've got all of the patients from Florida that have a dark blue date and I just happen to say uh, for my dark blue I said just give me the ones that are this month then I said alright let's just pick a certain week and I'm gonna highlight those in white font so if I come over here and filter by color I can pick with that fill and with that color and now I've got the one patient who's I've seen in a given week, in a given month, in a given state and you can filter it that fast. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the filter off of that and now I'm not going to look at date anymore. I want to show you one more trick with multiple fonts. What I've got in the E&M codes is I've got filter by color and I've got three different cell colors set up here so if you only want to see the dark red ones there they are and if you only want to see the purple that fast you can easily get colors or you can say hey I want everything I haven't colored yet I've got a group that I help uh, with pivot tables and with some uh, some of their data and one of the things they'll do is they'll download their receivables into a table like this off of a pivot table that we've created and then they'll assign over 120 day receivables to different uh, staff members and what they'll do is they'll pick a color and they'll, each time they need to assign one they'll assign that receivable to a different color so it's easier for them to see on the screen and when you've got it that way you can easily come through filter by a bunch of different colors and say just show me this employee or that employee or you can take F Florida off like that and now I've got all of them and that fast you can filter by font color by the background color or if you use conditional formatting which we're going to spend quite a bit of time on in future lectures you can filter that way too it's a cool new feature in excel 2007 hope you found that helpful thanks for watching